Hey guys, it's been a while, but I am back with another video for you. Um, mine's just going to be a quick little haul that I did recently and then a little life update. Um, just with the, what's been going on and why I haven't been making videos or anything. So, um, I don't know. I hope you enjoy it. And I do have more videos coming, so let's just get right into this one. Alright, so I did a little Dollar Tree haul the other day. Um, just got a few things, but I figured I'd share it with you guys. Um, I got this charcoal face mask, and it says it draws out dirt and impurities and clears pores. And I've been wanting to try a charcoal mask for a while. And this says to apply the mask, avoiding, avoiding eyes and lips, leave on for 10 to 15 minutes, and rinse off with warm water. Um, for dry skin, do it weekly, and more often for oily skin. Which, I have really dry skin, so I would probably only do it about once a week. Um, I also picked up the Sassy Chic, or Sassy Chick, BB Cream. I got mine in the shade Light. Same goes for this, but this is the CC Cream. And then I got this lotion. It's Dermacil Dry Skin Treatment Original Lotion. Um, it says it's good for super dry skin, which I don't think this will help out with my psoriasis by any means, but having dry skin anyway. I just thought I would give this a try for a dollar, and that's a pretty good size for a dollar. And then this by White Rain. It's the Boutique Collection uh, Facial Cleanser and Makeup Remover. It says it's a foaming face wash to gently remove makeup for soft, clean skin. And I also thought it smelled really good, so I wanted to give that a try. And then I believe these eyelash curlers are the Sassy Chick. Um, I, don't, I don't think those are LA colors, but either way, I wanted some with these rubberized grips on them, so we'll see how they hold up. And then I also got this little liquid foundation by LA Colors. I got mine in True Beige, which normally I go for ivory, but this seems to match me pretty well, so we'll see how that goes. And then I got this LA Colors Lipstick and Lip Gloss Duo in the shade Twinkle. I don't know why it's not focusing on it, but um, I'll show you a swatch at the end. It's super, super pretty. I did not expect the color payoff from the lipstick that you actually get. And then I got this LA Colors Matte Eyeshadow Quad in Matterific. And then I just got this Wet n Wild Icon Single Shadow in the shade Sugar. Here is the LA Colors Lipstick in Twinkle. And it's really hard to see the lip gloss because it's very sheer. But for some reason the color payoff is really not showing up on camera, but it's really pretty pink. It almost looks more of a corally color on camera. And then here's the Matterific Quad by LA Colors. And then there's the Shimmery White Wet n Wild Shadow in Sugar. And I also just want to give a shout out to this Clobetasol. My aunt had a few extra bottles of these laying around that she hadn't been using for years because um, I guess she had a little bit of psoriasis on her scalp and it went away. So she asked if I wanted it, and this stuff is a lifesaver. Since right now I can't get my hands on Clobex because I'm in between insurances and all of that stupid crap, um, I have like four bottles of this, and it's a miracle. I mean, from the last time I made a video, you can see how clear my forehead is just by using this stuff. It is amazing. Um, sometimes I use it twice a day, sometimes I only use it once a day, but it's amazing. It's amazing. I hold it right up there with Clobex. It's just as good. Um, I just hope that these bottles will last me a while until I actually can get onto my insurance and can get Clobex. Or what I really want to do is try to get on the pill for psoriasis because I've already tried so many other things which I've talked about before, but I mean... This is just as good for now. It makes me so happy to have it. 
And also, just a quick little life update. Um, since my son's first birthday in October, uh, I just haven't been making videos. I really haven't had time. My son has been teething like crazy. Um, and then with the holidays and all of that, and I can't film at home. Um, I just, I literally don't even have like a little corner to sit in to film and there's always somebody around and I like to be able to film when nobody's around because I'm still kind of new at this so it's still kind of weird and awkward if somebody's listening to me. So, um, I always come over to my mom's and that can also be a hassle when I want to do hauls or, you know, unboxings because then I have to haul everything over to her house and then take it all the way back home. And... You guys already know I still don't have my license, so I can't just drive myself. I'm always having to get rides, and it's just, it can be really frustrating and all of that. But what I really want to do is work on um, my blog this year and my YouTube channel this year and just really put more effort into it and get more videos out there for you guys. And I hope that you still want to watch them, and I hope that you tell your friends about them, and I hope I can help people. Um you know, that suffer with psoriasis or anxiety or anything like that, but I do want to incorporate more beauty videos and all that kind of stuff, so please bear with me. I promise I have more videos coming, and yeah, I'll be back soon.